What's up guys? I have another UU battle for you, and I lead with my Bronzong like normal. He hits me with the flamethrower, but I am heatproof, which messes up a lot of people, and it's kind of funny. So I set up Stealth Rocks, and he switches into his Floatzel, and I'm just going to Earthquake him. And I see that it's going to take three to kill him, but I'm not going to switch out, and I'm just going to stay in. And once he used Bulk Up, I got a little bit afraid, but I know Bronzong can take a Water-type move, even if he has 1.5 attack. And so he misses, which kind of stinks, and, you know, I, I hate it when people miss moves, but, you know, it happens as Pokemon. So back comes this thing, and he switches, and I get Specs, which is okay, because I'm going to continue to Earthquake, whether or not I have Specs or not. So I'm just going to keep going. And he T-waves me. I don't know why. Uh, all that really does is slow me down. Maybe he was going for the Parahacks or something. But he didn't get it. So now I'm locked into Earthquake. And in comes a Zapdos. So obviously I have to switch. And I was really worried. Because I really don't have anything that can take a Thunderbolt. Except for Bronzong. But Bronzong's only attacking move is Earthquake. Which I need to change. So he ended up going for Agility. Which kind of saved my butt because he had a sub and if he was thunderbolting there was a good chance he could possibly sweep my team. Because Zapdos is a huge threat to my team. Because like I said one of the only people who can tank a thunderbolt is Bronzong and his only attacking move is Earthquake. So I need to switch that because he needs to be able to kill Zapdos. So anyways he keeps using agility. I was a little bit confused. It's pretty obvious he's going to try to baton pass it. Because his Zapdos could already outspeed most of my team. So he's going to baton past the speed. And I'm kind of wondering who and why. Because like I said, he could have Thunderbolted me. And easily done a lot of damage with the Zapdos. So I ran out of Fire Blast. But that didn't really matter. So right here he baton passes. And he transfers all the stats into this Drapion. And uh, I was a little bit confused. Because... I, I was predicting Melodic or something, but he's not even going to be able to kill my Chandelier because I resist his moves. And he got a burn, so I kind of wasted a turn using Will-O-Wisp. I completely forgot about that, that if they use attacking moves, that there's a 30% chance they could get burned. But, oh well. So I used Energy Ball just to see how much <clears throat> damage it would do. I should have just used Shadow Ball, but Shadow Ball is going to kill him this turn. And all's well that ends well, so... After burn, he's going to end up dying, and that was a a pretty bad play in my mind on his part, because he shouldn't have set up uh, agility. He should have just gone for the Thunderbolts. So now I bring in my Hariyama, and I thought it would do less than 50%, and I'd be able to take two of those. But even though I resist it, it did, it did do 50%, which means it is going to two-hit KO me after Toxic, which is going to stink, because... I thought I'd be able to live too, and to be honest, I thought Ice Punch was going to do more, but turns out I was completely off on that play, and I do not end up 6 0ing him because I lost my Hariyama, which kind of stinks because I wanted to 6 0 his team. So, anyways, he's at 50% health, and I bring out my Heracross just to clean things up and finish the game because if you don't have a Ghost type Pokemon, there's a huge chance Heracross is just going to sweep your team because close combat has 100% accuracy and 120 damage, and once he gets the Moxie Boost, there's nothing that can take it. So uh, I end this battle with the Heracross uh, sweep, just like normal, and I do need to build another team, and I'm going to try to get one in. Just every time I play with a different team, I I don't know, I'm not as good, because I don't have a feel for them like I do with this team, because I've used it so much. But I'm going to try to get a new team and upload a video with a different teams so you don't see the same thing every video but anyways thanks for watching hope you enjoyed and subscribe